G'day viewers and good morning. Another beautiful day up on the mountain. This is the first of my video log type posts that I'll be putting on the channel. Just wanted to say, um, yeah, thanks for joining me. There's a couple of things that I wanted to talk about with regard to the direction that I'll be um, taking the YouTube channel and um, the content that I'm looking to release. We got heaps and heaps of really good feedback after I posted the image album on Reddit of what we're doing with our off-grid lifestyle change. It's, um, yeah, there was a tremendous amount of really positive comments and I wanted to say thanks for all that stuff, it was really cool. Um, many of those comments mentioned uh, stuff about wanting to see more around the mountain and what we're building and what we're doing and how we go about living our life up here. And I thought that would be a really fun project to get involved with. So, yeah, this is episode one. So, yeah, I've been living a full time up on the mountain pretty much, except for taking some weekends off and seeing people and stuff for about three or four months now I guess it's been um, it's been really interesting life changing that's for sure in a very positive way we we've worked on our shed um, structure the surplus military infield Australian Army accommodation uh, it was about 50 years old and in crates and we put it together over a couple of months, my father and I. And that's where we're pretty much staying at the moment. I'm staying in a tent. My dad and his partner are sleeping inside the shed. And that's sort of going to be our, our home base up here. Um, over the next couple of months, I'll be preparing materials for a, um, a cabin build. It'll probably be a reciprocal frame roof structure probably straw bale walls um, that'll be it'll probably take a few months to get the materials ready for that but um yeah that's probably going to be the next major project uh, we're still working on the shed and getting things uh, we've got the water going uh, we've got an interior and power supply a small solar setup but we're going to put in a larger one um, other things are mostly a that we're developing are around um, just being able to take care of ourselves in a sustainable way, growing our own food, um, getting a good protein source, whether that's with um, some small animals or um, aquaponics, gardening for sure, we've already started um, putting in the vegetables and things. So yeah, I've decided that I'm going to put out a couple of different videos as often as I can. It does take a lot of time to put them together, but essentially the feedback that I got was quite varied in what people wanted to see. They wanted to see sort of day-to-day -day stuff and um, sort of a journalist type things about how, how we're going. And other people were just interested in what we're building. Like um, they just want to see videos of projects start to finish. And those those things sort of take a long time to put together, but I want to I want to do both. Like I want to put out build videos as well as a sort of a continuous blog that will feature parts of the building, but it won't be like in a in a complete sort of lifestyle channel, sort of start to finish in one episode sort of thing. It'll be about the long process, but I will also have those build videos when projects are completed, so you can so you can decide what you want to watch. They'll be. Um, they'll be labelled so if they come up it'll say you know a video log or it'll say build video and you can decide whether you want to watch that stuff or not what else did I want to say um, yeah I opened up a patreon account so if you want to support the production of these videos and stuff because they do take a lot of time and resources to put together and um, yeah if it all helps even like a dollar a month or whatever it the more the more support I get through that means more videos, more uh, more projects. Don't have to worry too much about the day job sort of stuff. And um, 
yeah but um yeah like that's in its infancy and the channel's only in its infancy now so you might not feel like <clears throat> supporting it yet I don't know whether it's going to be any good or not but um we'll see I, but I am pretty gun-ho about getting this project going so um yeah comment away subscribe let me know if you've got um yeah specific questions about what we're doing up here I, I'm trying to record as much of it as possible um the stuff that's sort of interesting to most people like uh, the big things like yeah like I said before how we take care of ourselves and things like that but yeah and I'm looking forward to sharing it um yeah that's about it this morning I just hiked up to this this rocky outlet on the mountain's a good spot to come to it's nice and chill good place to meditate a bit and get your thoughts together but yeah that'll be that'll be it for now um, there I've got a video of our build of our wood-fired stove coming up this weekend we installed our wooden stove that we acquired a couple of months ago we had to build a flume from scratch and a, a chimney cap for it to get it all hooked up to the shed but it turned out pretty good and um, just using uh, I mean we had to buy the the gal pipe for the flue but everything else was sort of just scrap materials we utilized some of the galvanized steel capping that came on the, the crates that the shed were in the military crates which was good and we're also, and it's just a good example of the type of projects that we get around and um yeah I'm looking forward to feedback on the videos it is it's not like a a small sort of thing they are like 20 minutes of going through the steps of putting it all together but I thought you know it's better to have it there so you can sort of skip through it rather than not have anything useful in there but yeah that, that'll be a good example of the videos to come what else is there working on a wicking bed for the vegetable garden uh, water efficient garden bed essentially um, pretty much got it all together and some stuff planted it doesn't look too impressive at the moment but I thought I'd give it a week and let all the stuff sprout up and look really pretty before I finished off a video so yeah those are uh, two things coming up and I'll probably have more videos like this explaining what we're getting up to and I'll take you on tours around the mountain and down to different areas we've got a couple of different types of ecosystem here and different animals when I see them and all that sort of fun stuff but I'll try to, you know, involve you as much as involve you all as much as possible, as much as you'd like to be involved, anyway. Righty, I've babbled on for long enough this morning. I better get back to the shed and do some work, do some building, living the dream. Radio guys, see ya. Tarn out.